today we're making a holiday salad that's like perfect for Thanksgiving or anything this time of fall, you know, with all the beautiful squashes. We've mm -hmm. got delicata squash, we've got acorn squash, and any of the really lovely squashes that you might be have hanging around your house. Butternut Use them. squash will work. Totally. Mm -hmm. And so we're going to make a marinade today, roast them, and then we're gonna top it on a beautiful salad. So this is an acorn squash and a little bit of a delicata squash. And the delicata squashes are really easy and you do not peel these. This is the beauty of them. You just cut them into little strips. I love that, not having to peel the squash. And it looks so, like this is what I love about it is that this skin, you can actually eat it once oh. you roast it. It gets soft enough that you can completely eat it. So and we're, we're just putting it on to a parchment paper lined baking sheet. And we have, our oven is preheating mm -hmm. at 350 degrees, and these are gonna roast for about 30, 45 minutes, depending. I always say if you put it at 400 degrees, it takes no time at all to roast. <laughs> and actually, sometimes I have a convection oven, we have a convection oven, and you can totally use it, and it, half the time. Yes. So now we're going to make the marinade for these. And dressing. So the dressing acts as both a marinade and um, what we're going to use on our greens. Two for one. That's Love right. It. So in the bowl, Megan's going to whisk together two tablespoons of apple cider vinegar, two tablespoons of maple syrup, 100%. And then we're going to add the, it's three quarters of a teaspoon of the chili powder blend. Love that. Right. And then we're gonna add, mm -hmm, and then we're gonna go ahead and add a tablespoon of Dijon mustard here. I'm making a mess of my little thing. Mm -hmm. We're gonna add a quarter teaspoon of cumin. We're gonna add a quarter teaspoon so fragrant. of salt and a generous pinch of cayenne. Yeah, so depending on how spicy you like it, play around with the dressing. And you can also add cinnamon to this too, if you like, but today we're keeping it this. All right, and then I'm going to have Megan whisk a quarter cup, well it's actually a little less of a quarter cup. You want a quarter cup total, but then you wanna be able to take and, and use the, um, a little bit of the oil. And we're gonna take our brush and we're just going to paint all of our wonderful... This is where Peg's gadgets come in to hand. I would say too, you could always just whisk it into a little bit larger of a bowl, put the squash in there, kind of put them in. Well, the thing about this is you're gonna baste it twice. So this is really nice to just kind of baste it. And then and this is gonna... what she's doing right now is basting. Mm -hmm. And then I'm gonna cut it. And then in about half the cooking time, I'm going to then flip them and baste them again. All right. Okay. You guys, the smell of this. Holidays. Wonderful. Into the oven she goes. These were baking for a total of about 40, 45 minutes. So halfway through, I flipped them, basted them again with our dressing marinade, and now we're ready to assemble Look our beautiful salad. They're so yummy. So what we're gonna do is we have a bowl of beautiful arugula, bitter radicchio, greens. Mixed greens. Just fabulous. Whatever your favorite salad yeah. is. And we're gonna just gently, lightly toss mm -hmm. with a little bit of the dressing. What we had left over from what we basted with. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna just toss this really gently and then go ahead and let's put the plate right here, Meg. Right here. And you have a oh. serving plate. So imagine if you're having, you know, mm -hmm. five people, ten people, whatever, for your holiday. You can imagine, you can you just know, double, triple the recipe. Exactly. And so thing. what we're going to do is make go ahead and we, we have, have some manuri cheese, which is a sheep feta. We have these and pomegranate I'm, aerials, mm -hmm. which we are obsessed with. These We got these at our farmer's market and mm -hmm. they have them, but other stores, grocery stores have them and so yeah. they're really super easy. And then toasted cashews and mm -hmm. lightly toasting is just putting them in the pan. It's all mm -hmm. good. And then why don't you put a little bit of the manuri, the cheese. So I always do the cheese. Sheep, goat, feta, whatever is your yeah. pleasure. And then we're it's just, just a mild to... cheese with the sweetness and of the dressing and the squash and the pomegranates. It's always so nice having a little bit. And then having the, the roasted um, squash 
I'm gonna put have this more. beautiful flavor. It's yeah, just, this, this is really oh all about gosh. the squash. It really is. And this is so beautiful. I love it. Let's put some fresh, fresh ground pepper. pepper. So Amazing. for this wonderful fall salad that you can feel really happy to serve your family or your friends. <laughs> this is beautiful. You can go to currygirlskitchen.com. You can visit us on Facebook, Pinterest, Instagram. Follow us on all of those. And if you don't subscribe to our YouTube channel, subscribe. And you can get notified every Wednesday when we post yummy new recipes like this. We are grateful. Yes. Wish you all happy holidays. <laughs>